You got to watch the energy you put out into the universe. You just got to. If you don't know by now, Jacksonville rapper Julio Fulio shot to death along with other, three other people who made it at a Holiday Inn on his birthday, celebrating his birthday. If you know who Julio Fulio is, you already know that the main thing that he does in his songs is this, everybody. There, there, there's literally, literally no picks when it comes to the ops that he diss. What's so crazy about this is social media is, is really uh, feeling indifferent about this because everybody know that he disses. But there's also a lot of people that actually like Julio Fulio's personality, character, charisma, whatever you want to call it. And because honestly, besides all the dissing and the killing, he didn't seem like a bad guy, you know? Um, but can't overlook, you know, the killing and the dissing that him and his his, his his crew is allegedly, you know, accountable for uh, or or been, you know what I'm saying, accused of. So this, this, this whole situation is crazy, and it's just – it's just so wild how uh, desensitized we are to death and and just tragedy. Based, and I think it's because of the music, like the very music that most of the young kids listen to is "Murder, Murder, Kill, Kill." That's all that's out here for you to vibe to. How can you vibe to that when you, it's always talking about killing somebody, smoking on somebody, something, and if you talk about this stuff long enough, if you operate in that energy long enough, that energy will reciprocate itself back to you. The universe is real. And it's sad because the young the young kids, the young folk, don't understand that. And most of them don't and won't. And they're going to pass away. You know, they're going to die in the streets. I'm just, I'm glad that I'm, I'm older now and can see the just the pattern, the cycle is so stupid. And then you got his ops, you know, you got the, the enemies, whatever you want to call them. They happy that he died. They couldn't wait. You know, they on Instagram gloating, making a post and videos and all that. And it's just like, do y'all not understand the same thing can happen to y'all? And it probably will because you are celebrating death. You are clowning somebody dying as if that you're untouchable. I don't understand these kids nowadays. I really don't understand them. And I'm not even I'm not even that old. I'm only 30 years old. I'll be 31 next month. I'm not even that old. But I feel so much more mature and older than these younger m that's only like 28. They like 28, 27, 26 and down, you know? I think Julio might have been 26 or something like that, 27 or something like that, but it's just a, a sad situation overall, but you do get you get what you put out here. That man was dissing, and you know he used one of Fantasia beats, went to a grave site, was rapping on rapping dissing the dead on the grave site. Just all type of stuff that you just don't do if you're just trying to live a long life. If you're trying to live long, this is not the thing. This is not how you do it. That's not that's not how you do it. You're not no. So it's it's, it's just. Terrible situation all the way around. Definitely prayers to the family, but something else I wanted to address was I seen his girlfriend posted on Twitter and said, you know, what she said, like, oh, y'all took him from me and, you know, whoop, whoop, whoop. But I I, I don't even want to, you know, get too much on her, but for my for my ladies out there, when do y'all stop dealing with the, the, the dudes who are in the streets that can lose their life based on how they moving? I don't even understand, like, I, I, honestly, I don't even understand how dudes like this, and no, no disrespect, but how they be having girls, like real, like, like real girlfriends. It just goes to show you that a lot of women don't even use their brains and no logic when it comes to dealing with a man. All you got to do is woo-woo you with a couple things that you like, and you in there, and you, and you stuck. And now you grieving because that same man who woo-wooed you with all this stuff it's be the very reason that these brothers be dying. And now you on it now you on the internet talking about, oh, I hate y'all. You took my baby. You, you took my boyfriend from me. Don't nobody want to hear that though. 
as a black man who didn't got uh, it didn't evolve from the shit, I'm, I, I don't want to see it. Nobody, I don't want to say nobody cared, but bro, you that's beating a dead horse. It's like you knew what you was picking, right? You knew what lifestyle that was that you was you was getting yourself into when you was dealing with them. So stand on that. It just sad all the way around, and it, this these are the young girls. Same way, they know, they no different than the dudes. They they just not killing, but they they got their same. They got their own little young tendencies and stuff, and and cycles that they don't see either, and they all contribute to each other, to just keep us set back, bro. Set back. And I think about this shit like, yo, I think I really think about like, and, and where are we gonna be at in twenty years? Like, I'm really realizing that you know that my age is my. The people in my age bracket, we are the new adults. And that's wild for real. So now I'm thinking about it 20 years. I'm 50. What the what are these adults gonna look like? Are we even gonna have any? At this rate, I feel like we're not even gonna have that many. And it's just it's just a wild situation altogether, man. But this stuff, it, it's it's so stupid to say it gotta stop, duh, but it don't. And I'm so past saying they gotta stop. I just want people to 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 notice the the cycle, you know. And even that's cliche, but you gotta point out how the universe will really it'll really mess with you in the right way or mess with you in the wrong way. They, this man was dissing the ops. Now he's 23, and then you die on the 23rd. You know, celebrate your birthday. You 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 diss the ops. One of the ops got killed on a birthday, and then you put that in a song, and then it happened to you. It's crazy. I'm kind of rambling because it's just kind of. I'm just try, just man. Every day I get older and older, man. I just realize it, man, and I just be like, yo, this is this is this trash. This is trash. This whole world is trash. This whole whatever you want to call it, simulation, whatever you want to call it, it's trash. It's trash for real, and I'm I'm really sick of it for real, and I just want to keep my son away from all this stuff, man. But you let me know what you think about this in the comments, man, for sure. Make sure y'all staying safe, staying easy, staying protected, and getting them folk out your circle that ain't supposed to be there because they saying that this man got backdoored by somebody that was right in his circle. We live in different times now, and then the man who – and then, and then, the, then the one of his main ops drop a song right after he die, and he's saying self incriminating stuff. You snitching on yourself, even if you didn't have nothing to do with it. They're about to look at you, and y'all already got a long standing beef, and that that the feds know about. And you drop a song. I I really just I don't understand. I don't I don't get the 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 logic until you start thinking about who these people signed to, who these brothers signed to. And what they forced to do and pushed out to do and, and what's being pushed out there. Not they ain't getting forced to make the songs. That's what actually get them signed. That that mindset gets them signed. But the fact that it's being pushed out there, they don't even understand, man. They don't even understand, man. They dropped their song right after this man died. It's crazy. Let me know what you think about this in the comments, man. I'm out.